everyone. The Vigor 2760 is an ADSL and VDSL router, but with the latest firmware, a new feature has been added to convert one of the LAN ports so it can be used as an Ethernet WAN. This will allow it to be connected to a broadband service such as the National Broadband Network, otherwise known as the NBN. In this video, I will show you how you can configure the Vigor 2760 Delight router to use the LAN port number 4 as an Ethernet WAN interface. The first step is to log into the router. Once you have logged in, you will need to go to the WAN General Setup Configuration menu. You will notice the message on this page that states that when WAN 2 is activated, WAN 1 will be disabled and also LAN port 4 will now become WAN 2. Now select WAN 2. We now enable WAN 2 by selecting yes for this option. You will notice the physical mode is Ethernet. You may need to change the physical type to match the device the router will be connected to. For our example, we will leave these at our default setting. Now click on OK to save the settings. The router will need to restart to save the settings. So click on OK and reboot the router using the current configuration. Once the router has restarted, we go to WAN Internet Access Configuration menu. WAN 2 will need to be configured here. For WAN 2, select the required access mode. For our example, we will use static or dynamic IP option. Next click on the Details page button to complete the configuration of WAN 2. For our example, we are using DHCP. For this, we just need to select the Enable option and also select Obtain IP Address Automatically. Then click OK to save. The router is going to restart again to save the configuration changes. Once the router has restarted, we can connect LAN port 4 of the router to the internet service, which can be the NBN connection. To verify that WAN 2 is now working, we go to Online Status Physical Connection page. Here we can see that WAN 2 details are in green colour and it has a valid IP address. We can test the connection by trying to connect to a website. I will try going to dratech.com.au. The connection is now working. Thank you for watching. For more information, please go to our website www.dratech.com.au or you can send an email to sales at dratech.com.au